Hey, King Neo here. Uh, here with a stock market special. A lot of you are bleeding and hurting in the bear market that we're facing right now, and uh, don't know what to do. So here we are. So in short, ride the fucking bear, and you'll see why. So why are we even doing this today? So by next week, we would be seeing 2.25 million unemployment claims in the US. And this is not even an exaggeration. It's actually quite conservative and coming straight from Goldman Sachs. And um, yeah, why? Look at the world out there right now. People are dying freaking everywhere asia europe americas something's gotta give and as you can see dow jones the new york stock exchange s p everything it's all going down and it's for good reasons dead workers don't produce locked in quarantine people don't produce the only thing that's propping up the market right now is their endless printing and the printing press it's either gonna run out of steam or we're gonna face some kind of hyperinflation so don't be this moron and keep pushing it will drive you down and you will die do what we're gonna tell you so if you're in the states you're lucky lots of uh, these um, trading platforms are offering either free trades or trades that you can get for pretty much for free and for our friends in Canada there's not any choices one of the ones that I've been hearing about is well simple you can do free trades but uh, it's pretty lacking in terms of um, <clears throat> features but for our intents of and purposes it's enough all you need to do is just do simple trades no margin calls no options nothing like that so in the states you have lots of choices but I'm not telling you to get all these here what we want to focus on is just the big indexes and not focus on the industries why with industries, you can have the government or one of these um, big whales coming in and just manipulate the market and kind of fuck up your plans. So what you want to do is focus on the big indexes and have leverage going to two times or even three times. And I'll explain in a second why that matters. So. <clears throat> for example, you can go for something like this one or the free x like this one. So these are just hitting the Dow Jones. And for NASDAQ, you got something like this or something like this. And for S&P, you can either look at something like this or something like this and you can basically forget the rest why they can just mess with these and inject money print money whatever and or like the oil and gas they'll just opec will step in and just change the price and you know really fuck you up so don't do those So with Canada, similar deal. You don't want to be dealing with the gas or gold or anything like that. Just stick with the regular stuff. Go with something like the Nasdaq or S&P. Maybe go with the S&P with the TSX mixed in. Just get out the energy, get out that, and even gold is highly manipulative right now so stay away from those and um, yeah one of the reasons is the same thing you don't want anything that can be messed with by either government intervention or industry intervention 
and you will be doing okay. So why why we've been doing this is for the last month and a half, once we've been uh, looking at the whole uh, situation of people getting sick, dying in China, dying in Italy, dying in Iran, we see the core problem that people are not going to work, factories are not producing, people being locked in and not spending money. So until they fix all those, the market is going to keep going down and it's just going to be a bear. Don't be the moron and keep trying to push it out. Just ride the freaking bear. So hopefully you seen something useful today. Comment if you find this useful or even agree, disagree to what we're saying. Like, subscribe and share. And hopefully by now you have a good enough supply of masks so that you can walk around as little as possible and just go and pick up supplies, stock two, three months of uh, food and supplies, have guns and ammo. If your country allows, baseball bat and axes can work pretty well too in close combat. Fuel, butane, gas, wood chips, whatever, and start planting your freaking garden because we will face shortages and a long while of it too. Deep pantry and obviously water supply because even without food for a few days you do okay but without water for a few days you would be in very bad condition. Alright so we'll be back to our regular reporting tomorrow and hopefully get into these uh, special reports again. Thanks.